Chloe. And I'm Gabby. I'm Angelina. And for our silver award, our troop renovated one of our local elementary schools' uh, courtyards. And for our part of the project, we renovated the greenhouse as well as the garden. And this involved um, cleaning out and washing the greenhouse as well as supplying it with new materials and also um, weeding the flower beds, painting them, and planting new plants and flowers. Some difficulties that we faced was cleaning out the greenhouse, getting dirt and bugs out of it, and we put new supplies in, which made it better. Um, some like important things that we have learned throughout doing this project is like how to work together well and like all put work into it like together and all that stuff. Ella and Mia from Girl Scout Troop 45 and we recently finished our silver award project which is painting the courtyard steps at STEM Intermediate School. The ways I personally enjoyed being outside and getting to work in that environment. I enjoyed using a roller to paint instead of a brush because it went way quicker. Uh, I enjoyed getting the materials from Home Depot. And that was our Silver Award project, and it was very successful. Thank you. Hi, our troop renovated the courtyard at one of our local elementary schools. Our group was in charge of gardening. Our favorite part was working together with our friends and giving back to the community. Um, it was really hard for us to all like learn how to garden because it's definitely a taxing thing to learn how to do, but eventually we did learn and we overcame that and it turned out really great and it was really rewarding in the end. We all agree that by the end, we learned that each of us love working with other people rather than ourselves and that when we work together as a team, we can work more efficiently and have better results. Hi, my name is Emma. Hi, my name is Jessica, and we've been working on our Silver War project for over a year. We were concerned on the mental health of teens and teens, so we're making You Are Not Alone kits to help them get their minds off things. These bags consist of colored pencils, notebooks, and sketchbooks, and they'll be distributed throughout the Patman district. Bye! Bye. We are Aiden Hahn, Grace Davis, Ivana Sardu. Isabel Seco from Troop 27. We want to help our community. We thought our community had so many wonderful local parks and gardens, and a lot of people don't always know about them or go to them. We also wanted to help the wildlife in the area, such as birds. We wanted to give them a safe place to go in the winter. We brainstormed and came up with the idea to build birdhouses that would help birds and place the birdhouses in local parks. We just also decided to make videos that would let people listen to each of us talk about the birds and learn about them, and we would find a way to help people see those videos when they were near the birdhouses. We thought this would enhance the beauty of the parks and draw more people to visit and teach people more about some of the birds in the community. We researched local birds and each decided on a bird to support. We each made an informational video about the birds and researched the best type of bird how for the birds. We communicated with the town of Huntington Parks Department to find the best place to put the birdhouses and we reached out to a local lumber company to get donations of primed wood to construct the birdhouses. The parks department decided they wanted us to spread out to the birdhouses and place them in four different parks. We learned a lot during this project and we faced challenges and solved problems. We also learned about ourselves. Now we know that we can each make a difference in our community. Thanks to Girl Scouts, we got to have this experience and make the community even better. We are proud of our project and are going past the birdhouses make us so happy. We hope you'll visit the parks to see our project and learn more about some local birds.